I canceled one of my plans last <laughs> night because I was like, I don't want to go out in this mess. No, no way. way, right? It was no. so much rain yesterday and it was a cold rain too. Well, you know, today was much better because we did wake up with sunshine. A bit of a breeze though. Yeah, I probably noticed that the second you walked outdoors. Now the wind thankfully has come down some as that storm system is moving away. Our high temperature out there today, not quite normal, but getting closer at 55 this afternoon. Our temperatures are in the upper 40s from Greensboro to High Point and Winston-Salem all in the mid to upper 40s. Look at the wind gusts earlier today. They were moving at about 20 to 30 miles an hour. Now the wind has come down. Calm winds in a few locations, light west and southwest winds in others. Mountain communities, 30s right now. 36 Sparta, 38 Galax. You may have had a few flurries flying around earlier today. Low to mid 40s showing from Yakaville to Elkin. Our strongest winds in the area that was under a wind advisory earlier today with some 50 to 60 mile per hour wind gusts in our mountain mountain communities. Now, thankfully, the wind coming down in the mountains as well out of the west and northwest at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. So again, that storm system's moving away. Our front has come through. Now we have mainly clear skies and we do have a good bit of sunshine in the forecast. We got some much needed rain, though, with well over an inch in Winston-Salem and Greensboro yesterday, close to that in Burlington and Asheboro. Hamptonville, about an inch and a half. Tobaccoville, almost an inch and a half as well. Now, of course, today we didn't get any rain at PTI Airport, but we are at least cutting into that deficit. We're still a little bit below normal by about a half of an inch, but we are above normal for the year and we do have rain chances this week. Some passing showers in the forecast on Wednesday should be dry in time for Thanksgiving. A bit cooler than normal with a high of 54. By afternoon temperatures around lunchtime will be in the upper 40s. We'll have mostly sunny skies with increasing clouds, so not totally blue out there. And we're also going to have a bit of a breeze. If you plan to be outdoors, it will be a little brisk. Here is our satellite and radar right now, which shows us dry skies. So that means we'll stay clear tonight. You'll need to bundle up as we're down to 33 tomorrow morning. Foothills, heavy jackets for sure. We're going to dip down just below freezing. And with the light winds and clear skies, we may have some patchy freezing fog in our foothill communities. Now the wind should stay up a little bit in the mountains down to 30. Also going to need your winter gear at least for an hour or so in the morning. Your triad climb takes us into the low 50s by noon, a high near 60 tomorrow afternoon. So we are getting warmer and we'll look for temperatures in the upper 50s, close to 60 in the foothills as well. For the mountains, the high tomorrow afternoon under sunny skies is up to 53 degrees. So if you're going to be traveling in the next couple of days across the Carolina, Remember that tomorrow we start off in the 30s. We have plenty of sun with temperatures that are in the 60s down toward the coast. Wilmington at 64, 61 in Columbia. And then by Tuesday, also dry skies. Warmer in the morning, upper 30s, and warmer in the afternoon, where we'll see temperatures that will be in the 60s. We're also going to look at some cloud cover coming in there on Tuesday. We've got a rain chance in here for Wednesday. A few passing light rain showers with a breeze. Temperatures in the low 60s. That front comes through, cools us off a little bit for Thanksgiving Day with a high of 55. Then we get another round of rain coming in here over the weekend. All right, still to come.